Okay guys, so today we're heading back to property control. We're gonna go ahead and show you what's new today and check out to see if they have any pins on their pin board. Let's see what they have outside first. They've got some new chairs, if you guys haven't seen these yet. Let's check these out. I think these are the ones that have like those plastic things between them. Got some bins it looks like. Let's see what the prices on the chairs. So the chairs look like they're five dollars they're those kinds of lounge chairs you got some of these things too these are like laundry carts i think what you would do with those but a dollar for the laundry cart some kind of cart some more carts oh look at this table this table's massive i mean what a great knights of the round table right look at that that's a great one three bucks three bucks guys what else can i show you down here let's see oh they've got some blue barrels got some bins we got we like i said we picked up a couple of these blue barrels for rain barrels last time and these were like a dollar i think the price tags faded on them and then they got some shelving so yeah let's head inside and see what we can find inside and what is it a treasure chest yeah well, that's a cute little bin I didn't bring my glass. a dollar uh, what are those oh they are but the only one that has stickers is the first one so it's for, you can write on them. But yeah, some dry erase boards we've got. Looks like the, head, oh, they've got one of the headboards left. Let's see what they've got, guys. Let me see. These are $3. Where do these come from? Oh, we should pick these up. Oh, these are, these are props. Oh, we should pick all these up, Mom. We should pick all these up. Mom? Yeah. Yeah. Because these are props yeah. that they call use in the parks. Mm -hmm. Those are cool. For parade stuff, yeah. Look at that light. I love that, that light. Amazing? Yeah. Okay. Boy, there's a lot of good stuff today, guys. Lots of good stuff. Look at this one. This is a good one, too. This light. Um, when is this auction supposed to happen? Auctions end 410. Okay. Let's see. Oh, we got a TV and a stand. It's a really stand. I guess maybe they used it for this is fifty dollars. This is old as is. And look at this light, guys. Isn't this light phenomenal? I actually love it. I actually am in love with it. And it is twenty-five dollars. Hmm. Oh, this is nice. Looks like one of those sinks from Animal Kingdom. How pretty is that? That one's really cool. Let me turn this down just a little bit. That looks really cool. That is $25. Wow. Amazing. Amazing. Oh, these are neat. I wonder where these are from. Does anybody know? If you guys know where these are from, let me know. These are really neat. $45 for that one. Oh, they're really cool. There's one with the man array and the sea turtle. And that one looks like it is two hundred fifty dollars. Hmm. I wonder if these, where these came from. All the hardware's in there. Got some wallpaper. Still got some of those Christmas stuff. Some of that garland. Some of the wreaths. That looks nice. Oh, they're getting a bunch of the Polynesian stuff up there. You guys can see that? Those weren't up there last time. This is new. That's new. How much are the chairs? These chairs are Some of that flooring, some of that great flooring. Some of the these are beautiful. Those are amazing. Look at how pretty these are. These are $125, but these are massive, guys. These are like four feet wide. Look at this one. So pretty. That's a beautiful one. Isn't that pretty? For the top of the house. Yeah. Yeah, that's beautiful. I love it. 
Oh, they got some of the H2O shower gel. Two dollars. I, I heard that it's very nice, yeah. But I bought four of them. Did you? It smells good. Yeah, I don't put it on myself right now. I just go traveling, you know, like yeah, stay yeah. in my house or something. So this is a brand that they kind of just continued in the parks. All right, got a couple more big wreaths. Just look at the decorations and all this. 75 for that giant one. Wow, those are really pretty. Those are really pretty. Um, got some more glasses. 50 cents. Some jars. Look at these jars. Some jars for 50 cents. For two dollars, I'm sorry, the jars are two dollars. We've got some monitors. I guess these are little TVs. Okay, I got a lot of them. Let's see. Oh, this so my mom said she felt like oh, uh, these just need to be recovered. As well. She felt like these chairs were from the Grand Floridian. Those are from. We got some over here. These ones obviously need to be recovered. They're pretty stained up. And these ones are five dollars. And these ones are ten dollars. Those are pretty though. Those would be easy to recover. Um, got some bar stools. These are super cute. Some little bar stools. I wonder where those came from. Hmm. They definitely need a cleaning, but they're super cool. And of course, the old, all the props that we looked at last time. This is a place where all the props kind of go for retirement. Oh, that one's new. I haven't seen that one. The Monsters, Inc. one. Look at that one. That one's new. They're really ordering, add, adding a bunch of new props. Of course, we saw Ursula. You've got this one, which is amazing. I love the tree. I love the four parks representation on this one. So you've got the Tree of Life. And then over here, we've got the Earful Tower, which I miss. And then we've got the Epcot Ball. And then on the back side is the castle. This must light up, I think. But on the back side here is the castle. Also, see, this is giving you guys a better view so you can see everything. This is that teacup that we talked about. Um, let's see, of course, this. I'm gonna get some of this. And we've seen, we talked about this before. This is that the Orlando Airport. But that is the property control, guys, in a nutshell. Isn't that cool? It's very, very cool. Very cool. All right, now we're going to go back. We'll check out a little bit of the merchandise. We'll check out the pins. And then I'm going to go ahead and show you um, the food, because I know you guys like to look at the food, too. So these are the new, cr these are Crocs. What are the price points? I mean, a lot of these guys, I don't spend a lot of time in the merchandise area, because a lot of this stuff um, is already is at the outlets anyway. I come for property control and I come for the food. But a lot of this stuff you're gonna find at the outlets for sure. But yeah, like I said, I don't do a whole lot with the merchandise end of it. I do look at the pins and I look at the um, food. So let's, ooh, this is kind of cute. A little sports bra type thing with a Mickey, Mickey Run, Outdoor Voices, $70, it was $70, 10% off. It's still kind of pricey for me but okay let's go over here oh it looks like they've moved the pins around looks like they've moved the pins around a little bit mm. let me see so they've got some lanyard sets they've still got that halloween one they've got the hocus pocus and the jumbo one let's see what's on this side did i miss it no we've got some hats and some other stuff other stuff hmm. Hmm. What do they do with all the pins? What are they make them to? Okay, so we've got some pins over here. These are the ones that are still, I mean, I still think that these are really pricey. I mean, yeah, for one pin, it was 50 bucks. Now down to 14. There's one little mystery pin in there as well. And these are kind of hard to, this is, I think, mini theme. This one was Alice in Wonderland theme. We've got to show you guys. 
Oh, here's some of the mural verse pins. And these ones are $4.99. So those prices really came down. It was $17.99. It's now $4.99. Um, let me see. They've moved out a lot of their pin stuff. Are these pin binders? <laughs> yeah, I'll watch it. I didn't want to leave it because somebody took those cards. Okay, I'll watch them. Thank you. I got it. Oh, the Grogu Lounge lies twenty four ninety nine. Yes, it's probably in the in the in the um, outlets. So here's some pins that they have. Don't see anything really new that we don't have that we don't need. Um, but you know, I mean, it's so like the overstock that they have. The Merry Christmas one was seventeen ninety nine at six ninety nine. Still a little bit pricey. The Time Turner one with Kronk, $7.99 was $21.99. So you can find some really good deals here. Um, these Darling ones, which these are so stinking cute. But man, you know that this one's too short, so it always drops off. So those were $19.99. You can get them for $4.99 here, depending on which one you're looking at. I think some of them might be still a little bit more, but the Darkwing Duck, isn't that a great one? Dancing characters, $8.99. It was $19.99. Um, Mr. Toad, $8.99. was $19.99. So yeah, you can find some good pins. Get that. $24.99 down to $7.99. They have Gamora. They have the reindeer ones. Um, what is it? Christmas? You guys know what I'm talking about. All right, and then we still got some of these ones. Of course, this is from the defunct Chandra line. Was $9.99, $3.99, $4.99, $5.99, $6.99, $7.99, $8.99, $10.99, $11.99, $12.99, $13.99, $14.99, $15.99, $16.99, $17.99, $18.99, $19.99, $20.99, $21.99, $22.99,
And before I talk to you guys about the hot dogs, these are the foot long hot dogs. They do have the buns for those. The meatballs are really good. When I talk about the, these two guys, they're really good. They're super filling, so they're too much for me with spaghetti. But what my husband and I do is we cook, put them in the air fryer, get them nice and crispy and well done, and then we dip them in marinara sauce. So it's just a nice kind of like a protein. Like you need some, you know, sometimes you just feel like you need some meat. It's a nice little, you know, addition. But it is a lot in pasta because it's so filling. They also have onion rings, they have biscuits, they have ribs, it's $24.99 for that big slab of ribs, big stack of ribs, it's really a good deal. Uh, let's see what else. So the orange juice we told you about before, the gallons um, are $3, the little bottles are a dollar. I mean, you can't beat that. We've got cucumbers, this is a fresh kind of area. We got red peppers, $1.33. That's actually a really good deal for peppers. 75 cents for the green, we got celery, we got avocados. And we talked about the bacon before. So the bacon is amazing. So it's like a 10 pound thing of bacon. And it's like that pre-cooked stuff. So all you gotta do is kind of warm it up and you can add it to whatever sandwiches or whatever you need for breakfast. It's really a quickie thing. Oh, okay, so today they also have the pork tenderloin. If you guys can see, that's a huge, or they have, I'm sorry, not the pork tenderloin, they have pork butt. As you can see, that's a huge package. Uh, for $27.99. It's a great grab. Uh, we have broccoli and kale. Big bags of those. The eggs. I do like to get my eggs here. And I know you guys, some of you guys said the eggs were too pricey. But I do like this brand. And I like the containers that they come in. So we are going to get another thing of eggs. And let's see. The butter. You guys have seen the butter is $1.50. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. We've got big bags of cheese. They've got shredded cheddar, There's mozzarella up here. Um, yeah, some yogurt. And then of course we've got cookies. Um, I might grab a couple of those. Those are not the cookies that we're looking for. The cookies that we're looking for are the ones that are frozen. But let's grab some of these gourmet cookies. These are 35 cents. We'll grab a couple of these. Um, but the cookies that we're looking for is usually a big box of the frozen cookies. Um, and there's like 48 in there. And those are the cookies guys that you guys get in the parks that are this big. Um, they usually, they don't have them today. But then we have Swiss cheese, which is $8. Provolone cheese, which is $8. And then cheddar cheese. Like have a look guys, this is the cheddar cheese. Six bucks for this cheddar cheese. I mean, look how big this is, six bucks. Isn't that amazing? That's a good deal. Okay, and then we're gonna go into the milk. So we have gallons of milk, gallons of chocolate milk is 380. We have gallons of white milk, 325. But guys, they also have these little bottles of True Moo up here. My daughter was in love with these. True Moo is hard to get, but True Moo, they have them up here. Whole milk, True Moo, just 79 cents. It's a great grab. Okay, and let's go over here and we're gonna check out some of this stuff. So look at this big, I mean, guys, this big thinking, Hunk of thing of tuna, right? I mean, this is stuff that you get at Costco and Sam's Club, but it's $11. And then when I told you that they had the hot dog buns for the foot long dogs, the, those are those right there, the hot dog buns. Um, we've got a bunch of like spray, there's jasmine rice, we've got for flour tortillas, a great big package for $1.50. And these are the big ones. These are big ones like this, these are big size. We've got mayo for four bucks, mustard for $1.70. They haven't had ketchup lately. I mean, ketchup they usually have. Twinning teas. Look at that one. Um, we've got big packages of spaghetti, which are amazing. And then, guys, look at this classic rotini. So, this great big bag of this is 10 bucks. Can you guys see how big this bag is? 10 bucks. 10 bucks for that. Amazing. That's a good deal. And then, Pop Tarts. You guys need pop tarts pop tarts like crazy for a dollar we got silk milk up here some dressing black pepper yeah. some kind of spices salt you can get olive oil we've never bought this i mean it's a great deal too so the gallon of olive oil is twenty dollars but i just don't know where i would store it i mean it's such a it's a good deal but it's um it's pretty big there's their drink section they had the other day the pop oh there we are down there let's go check this out down there Let's see what we got here. Um, oh, they got a restock on the horse and cheese. We'll come back to that. Okay, so thanks, Pandora juice bars. I wanted to get some of these when we were here last time. So they say that the middle one is the best one, I guess. Um, maybe I want to try that. But it's 50 cents, guys. 50 cents. 50 cents. And they have two. They have the orange cream and they have the Pandora one. Frozen fruit bars. So we'll, we'll try one of these. 
And what else we got? Yeah, so guys, the Borston cheese, it's a great grab. Um, I think it's like $6.99 for that. The Uncrustables are 60 cents each. Hash browns, I don't think so. She's been pretty weird about stuff. Um, they are good. Sweet potato fries are amazing. Oh, right there in front of the Oh, yeah, yeah, okay, okay. Um, the French toast sticks are really good too. They're $12.25 each, and that bag is massive. We've got these ones, the hand tossed pizzas. They're a little bit, the, th the crust is a little bit too thick on there for me. These are $2.50. We got the Tornstone DiGiorno ones are $4.50. And then, of course, some drinks. Um, I know you think I'm talking to myself, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> but this French toast is very good. They are very good. My daughter loves them. You put in the side cream cheese and blueberries, bacon, and that's it. No way. I never thought about that. Cream cheese and blueberries. Like blueberries. And bacon. Yeah. That sounds so good. Yes. Wow. And you don't need nothing more. Yeah. Mm. Or the French toast coming with uh, the, I don't know, the, the maple syrup or something, the sugar. You don't need to look. Yeah. But if you want it, you put more. But I, I, I made it and I get cream cheese, blueberries, bacon. That's that sounds so good. I'm gonna have to do that. That sounds really, really good. So, is good. what, what is your favorite food item at, at, that you get here? The pizza is good. This one is good. Everything is good. Yeah. Yeah. I love those are really good. Yes. Yep. Those are amazing. Yes. And the hash brown. Yeah. Yeah. The pork tenderloin, the little one, but no have today. I know. I those are good too. Yeah. You guys haven't had the cookies for a while either. Yeah. Cookies. The, the big box of cookies. The big box. Yeah. Big box of cookies? Yeah. No, they won't do that anymore. Ever again? No. no. Because the price went up to like 70 or 80 dollars. For a box? Yeah. Oh, wow. Okay. All right. So don't look for those anymore then. That's good to know. Um, the long grain rice box is $16.95. So yeah. I mean, lots of fun stuff that we have always here. Again, this is more merch. I'm going to take you over and check out their boards, their pin boards. Okay. All right, guys, let's go over here and we're going to check out their pin board, their pin trading board to see if we can find any good trades. I don't see anybody who's trying to find it or anything like that here, but these are cute. These lounge flies recently reduced to $24.99. Look at how cute these are. Okay, yes. Let's see. So, yeah, I mean, these are adorable. $24.99. What was the regular price on these? The regular price was... $98. They're small though. That's the problem. They're small. It would hold your ears though. It's super cute. The $24.99 in the, they're probably, these are probably in the outlets too. So make sure you run over and get you one. $24.99 on those lounge flies and $24.99 on the gray Grogu ones. Tank tops. Oh, those are cute tank tops. Do you have any large ones? This is the problem with the clothes though, baby. Uh, people, a lot of times the clothes is always babies. Hey, you guys are my babies. Um, a lot of the clothes always come in either the small or the the um, extra, extra large. So the, the larges, of course, are always the ones that are snapped up quickly. This is a cute one though. They do have this marble one. Seems like it might be a little bit hot though. We got some totes. Ugh, I don't even know, like Florida. What, are you kidding me? I don't even know. I don't even know. I can't stand it. We got some of the munchlings, the Christmas munchlings. There's a Christmas one up there. There's a cupcake one. Those are cute. Very cute. Okay. We've got some of these guys. $24.99 for the spirit jerseys. These are probably in the outlets, this too, outlets right now too. And this is a medium. So it looks like they've got large. Yeah, they've got all the spirit jerseys. Mm -hmm. Uh, look at this one. That's a great one. Yep. Lots of fun stuff for sure. Some more munchling stuff. Uh, some more spirit jerseys. These are, I think these are the cast exclusive ones. Look at this jacket though. What the heck's up with this jacket? HH. I wonder what that means. HH. That's nice though. How much is it? HH. $99. It was regularly $250. Wow. Too rich for my blood. But still a nice jacket. Still a very, very nice jacket. 
<laughs> let's see what else we've got here. I've got the hiccups. I'm sorry, guys. I just went and had lunch with my mom, so I've got the hiccups a little bit. Um, let's see. Oh, this is a good one. It's a great t-shirt. Food and wine. A great, I'm, uh, I'm sorry, a great uh, tank. They do have a bunch of the wine and dine stuff, run stuff. Very, very cool. Very cool. All right, guys, let's go check out their pin board. Now, they don't usually have any good pins here, but I always like to look because you never know what can be on the board. So let's have a look and see what we can find. Oh, they've got a bunch of the Wakanda Forever ones. Got some other. This one looks like a good one, though. Got a couple of these. This is a good one. Look at this. That's a good one. That's amazing. Let's stick that back okay. in there. Um, we've got Judy Hop. This is a good one. Hidden Disney pin. Yeah, so they've got some good stuff on here today, guys. The Judy Hop. What else do they have on here? Yeah, usually this one is one that I got the other day in a mystery pack that I grabbed. Disney pins, four of five. You don't know a lot about that one. Um, let's see what else we've got up here. Yeah, so they do have some really some interesting ones added up there. It's sad because usually all the ones up here are scrappers and fakes, which is unfortunate. But you know, we still look because you never know what you may find up there. Huh. Okay, so I don't see anything else that's really exciting. But that is past connection. Look at the headgear. That's a good one. The headgear sign up there. But this is, of course, cast connection in a nutshell. Ooh, we didn't see these. Let's check these out. And again, these are probably, are these candles? Ooh, guys, it's a Melly candle. Look at that. $14.99. Smells like lemony kind of a little bit. I don't know what these are, magnets or something. Where'd these come from? Ooh, smug. Does these add a picture magnet? Hmm. A picture frame? I don't know if that's what it is or not. <clears throat> or what flag is that? American flag? It looks <clears throat> like it might be the British flag? England? England maybe? I don't know, yeah. I don't know guys, do you know what this, what flag this is? It's got roses. Yeah, I think it might be England. Ah, look at this. Little baskets. A lovely mess I am. Yep, we're a lovely mess. Okay, let's see. All right, is that all that we see that's interesting? Oh, Disney Apparel $4.99, what are these? Oh, marbles. What are they? Why are they $4.99? Recently reduced, like what were they? They were 60 bucks and now they're $4.99, but what are they? Are they shirts? Are they pants? I mean, what is it supposed to be? I don't know, like a shirt for a men? Hmm. Yeah, interesting. Let me see what these ones are over here. So these are um, these are marked down to four ninety nine. Christmas, Wakanda Forever, super cute. Okay, guys. So that's what we have in a nutshell in cast connection. Let me stay in here again and give you a little spin around. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. And like I said, every time that we come, we go through uh, property control and look at the food because property control is where it's at. I mean, that's where we find, like we're gonna pick up those $3 props that they used in a park. It'll be a fun addition to something. I'm sure Joe would love to have them. So we'll get those added to him. But let me go see if they have anything else that they've added since we've been in here. And let me know in the comments, guys, if any of you know where these chairs came from. Like I said, these ones just need to be reposted. And my mom thinks that those came from the um, Grand Floridian. Let me know if you guys know where any of these other ones came from. So we're going to go ahead and head out, and again, thank you so much for watching. Okay guys, and that is our trip to Cast Connection. Like I said, make sure that you tune in, click that follow button, click subscribe, because we're going to do more of these videos. We'll probably be coming once a week to come over and kind of show you what's new in property control, because for me, that's where the fun is, is to just see what new stuff is, is cycling out of, out of um, the parks and out of the resorts. and. 
you know, we got those really cute props for $3. I'm gonna have to look and see. I think those were probably used in some kind of parade or something or on a stage. So we'll check those and research those a little bit. We're gonna try our Pandora ice cream bar. And thank you so much for watching.